All right, Casey Cameron, but here with the SUV news first and Riverside accountability. Do working on the First Amendment out of here. This is where they had me arrested, guys. So we're gonna come and mess with them now. Are you any window? type of probation or parole or any type of uh, management program for your behavior here? Can I help you? Oh, uh, I just asked you if you're on probation or parole. Me? Yes. Right. How about how about with uh, with your employer? Are you on probation or parole with the employer? On investigation. Have you passed your 90 days? How long have you been here? Um, I'm not sure if I have to relay that information. Oh, okay. What, what was your name again? My name is Ashley. Ashley. Your last name? Uh, Maldonado. Maldonado. Do you have an employee number? I do not. Do you have a, a like a, something that identifies you besides your name here? Can I can I see your badge or does you have a badge number? No. There's no badge number on it. Can I just see your badge real quick? I mean, I I'm not sure. If I... Well, I'll, I'll just try to identify you. That's all. Okay. Well, I told you my name. Okay. I know, but there's probably like a lot of people with the same name. So can I just see it though? Um, can you hold on one second? I just need to verify if I. If Why? I why is that though? You're you're you work for the public. You should identify yourself. That's just common. That's the common thing to do if you work for the public. Yes. Yes. I don't think she likes the fact that we're asking them the questions that they ask people. Well, she's uh, she's on the phone saying that if they're asking me for my badge, I have to show it to them. Hello. Your name and badge number, ma'am. What is it? Amber Myers. Amber Myers. Do you have an employer or badge number? I'm sorry? Your employee or your badge number? 25. So she should have Probation 25. And does she have an ID number just as well as you do? No, she's clerical staff. She's what? Sorry, it's really hard to hear you. Clerical staff. Oh, okay. Clerical staff don't have IDs or anything like that. Okay. Very good. All right. Thank you. Are you resting something for the public? Are your restrooms open? Are your restrooms open? Yes, go ahead. Okay, thank you. Yeah, just wondering, just making sure. I'm gonna do a quick search right there. You guys are not hiding anything. So are clothes. you actually a sworn officer yourself? Yes. Oh, okay, and what, what position are you in? Um, I'm a supervising probation officer. Supervising probation officer, okay. Are you on any type of probation or parole that we should know about? <laughs> no. No, not today, huh? Not today. Well, you know how sometimes you guys are under investigation though so they put you like on a probation none of that huh none of that mishaps here huh good for you good for you thank you all righty you have any questions for her where can i get a public records request form here yeah for public records request form request cipro do they call it for you yeah i can get that for you yeah that'll be good i'll take one yeah i'll take one too two please no. How about yourself, ma'am? What's your name? I don't want no, But you working there, what's your name? That's how you have done it. What is your name? I don't know. You well. You're working here right now. What is your name? Have you ever seen anything? What is your name? Are you refusing to identify? Oh, okay. Where's Mayor at? I need her name here. She's refusing to identify. She shouldn't be working here then. Is this how you treat the, the, the people in provision? Really? That's how you treat people here. With disrespect, by not even identifying yourself. You're a public servant. Even if you're not a sworn officer, you're still getting paid off my money. You're standing there because of my tax dollars. If I don't do YouTube, if I don't pay my taxes at the end of the year, if I don't pay my taxes at the end of the year, you wouldn't be standing there. That's right, walk away, woman. I mean, I have a common opinion about you. I could say you're good looking, but I mean, would you have a common opinion about him? Come on. That is not professional. Come on. All right. Thank you. Thank you. So how long you been working no here comment. for? <laughs> no comment. Damn, they got you, bro. Hey, how long you been working here for? Almost six months. Six months? How you like it? I like it. If you see something that goes wrong here, do you report it? Do you report your own supervisor? Yeah, we don't have issues though. No? Because yesterday I was locked up and they were beating up some dude and the ladies that were clerics, they were just looking the other way. Is that what you guys do here too? No? You don't see people getting beat up and you just like, like, oh, I didn't see anything, no?
Are you sure about that? No, you never seen that? Not yet? Uh, are you lying to me or not? Can you raise your your right hand and swear that you're not lying to me? Are you an officer? No, no, but just just to make sure that you're not lying to me. No, I'm telling you I'm not lying to you. Man, I don't know. You guys are known for being liars. You know sometimes that I don't believe you. Yeah, but anyways, we're gonna wait for the photographer's request form. Do you know Do you know how much time it takes to print out a simple form for a public records request form? I'm not sure. You're not sure about it? You know how to print it out yourself? Can you print one for me and I'll teach you how? Just go to the system? Uh, she's printing it for you. You sure though? Yeah, she'll be back. 100%. 100%. She'll be back. She'll be back. Oh, okay, she's not hiding back there and acting like she's like trying to wait us out and stuff like that? No? All right, cool. cool. We'll wait then. What's going on? Hi. Were you able to get a form? Um, we actually don't have a form. I'm gonna give you the uh, email to contact our PRA officer. Okay. We would um, coordinate that with you. Oh, sounds good. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Thank you so much on that. Yep. Okay. Hey, what was the name of the lady that was sitting down on this side? Her name is Saria, but she doesn't work for probation. She okay. works for uh, behavioral health. Oh, interesting. But why is she in the front? Like, she should at least identify to people. What is it? Bro, I don't know about that though. It should be policy for them to identify too. Very hostile woman, oh, I tell you that. Uh, they should know each other though. Yeah. Wow. How long you been a probation officer here? Working with somebody years. for six months. 18 years? Yes. How you like it? Um, it's pretty good. You don't beat people up? No. Do Not I yet. Like I don't know, man. You, you, you never know in this day and age, you know, with the 911 and everything going on the around. This person could be the evilest thing. Yup, that's true. That's Sick, true. Uh, manipulations. She getting the email yeah. there and stuff. Okay. All right. So this is the um. This is our uh, officer who coordinates all of okay. the records act requests. All right. Okay, so just go ahead and email him, and he should be able to get that coordinated for right you. Right on, right on. So, uh, mayor, mayor, mayors, mayors, right? Mayor. Myers, all right, I'll tell them you, you sent me. Thank you so much for your time. Welcome Appreciate time. it, thank you. Appreciate it, thank you. What's going on there? Where are you going? What's oh, up, man? You chilling. Be chilling on that? Yo, what's good? What's good? What's good? Chilling, chilling, there you go. Homie King, hey, what's up, guys? You be channel's name, channel's guys. name. You be chilling 909, guys. Oh, right, there you go. I have the missus, the bodyguard over there. 1022, we got a bodyguard. Let's go, next spot, next spot. All right. Nah, I don't know about them here. Piece of camera, boy.